Hey all, welcome to Slay the Spire. Today we're playing the daily challenge for September 15th, 2020. The character is the Watcher, and the mod for our draft. Draft a custom starting deck of cards. Certain future, the map contains only one path. And Midas, enemies drop 200% more gold, but you can no longer smith at rest sites. As the Vorpal appear in second place, I think the first place person has been a cheater in the past, so for me, Vorpal is first place. Congratulations, really good score. Let me, before get, getting started, review my score from yesterday. I got 1909, and then a commenter on yesterday's run, Ed, uh, pointed out that I could have easily, very easily, gotten an extra 100 points by duplicating a curse towards the end, and gotten 2009, which would have t made me tied for second, and actually given that the first place is a cheater, it would have been effectively the first place tied with this person. So it's a little unfortunate, but I, I really missed it. Check out that video from yesterday. But anyway, back to today's run. All right. So with certain future, this is going to be a little more balanced. Uh, all right. So draft. I'm probably going to try to go for collector bonuses uh, since we only have one class of cards available. Although with the certain future modifier, that might be difficult. The elite is late, though, so that might give me a chance. Um, I think of these, it's hard to know which directions the deck will go, but Inner Peace, the card draw for Inner Peace seems like a good idea. And then Crescendo, so I already have a way to enter an Exit Wrath. Cut Through Fate, good attack card. Um, foreign Influence, up. Oh, actually, no, I have Midas, so I cannot Smith at Rest Sites, which makes the Foreign Influence a little worse. Let's go with the Tranquility then. Um, empty Fist, yep, that's good. I could do another Foreign Influence, but I think I'd rather go with the Empty Body. Meditate is pretty... Actually, I don't have good damage at this point, right? Except for the cut, cut through Fate. So let's take Wheel Kick. Another Empty Fist, sure. And one more. Why not? Collector Bonus. Actually, I can get a Collector Bonus for Empty Fist right now, right? I should sort A to Z right away. Yeah, I could just get another one. Or Empty Body. Maybe I should balance out with a little bit more defense. Let's take Empty Body, sure. Another Wheel Kick or Simmering Fury. Yeah, let's take that. Fear No Evil is great. And then Meditate. That'll be my second one. Uh, oh, no, for some reason I thought I took one. Uh, well, that'll be my first one. Flurry of Blows is not a bad idea because I have a lot of stance shift cards at this point. Let's take it, sure. Indignation is pretty good. Another Empty Fist, that'll give me the collector bonus I wanted, right? And I think that's it, okay. Let me review the deck. So I have, let's see, for defense, I have the two Empty Bodies. And uh, wait, is that it? I thought I picked up more defensive cards. Okay, so a little weak on the defensive front, but uh, offense I should be pretty good, which should get me through the first act fairly easily. But I would want to pick up a few more defensive cards if I can. All right, let's do Fear No Evil, Empty Fist for energy. Cut Through Fate gives me probably Indignation is not a bad idea. And then um, I can just kill with the Empty Fist, right? All right. Pray, Sashwood, just lucky. I think I should take a Sashwood for the Hexaghost I have coming up at the end of this act. All right, can't afford anything here. Sands of Time is not a bad idea for offense. Uh, I was kind of hoping to get defense. Flurry of Blows is probably good for the Collector Bonus. Uh, yeah, I think I'll take Flurry of Blows and Sands of Time. Okay. Couldn't really afford much more there. All right, Cultist. Uh, not getting attacked. Let's do Simmering Fury and then just do the attack cards here. Okay. I'll be in Wrath this turn. All right, I can do... Fl oh, actually, do I want to do Indignation first? Yeah, why not? Let's do Indignation, then Flurry of Blows, um, and then this kills. Okay. We got Distilled Chaos, as well as another Crescendo. Sure, I mean, I'm really going into the Stance Shift deck. Although, for the Hexagos, I really need to pick up some defensive cards. Okay, so I should be able to kill here. Let's do Indignation, and then uh, Sash Whip, Empty Fist. Oh, perfect. All right, Sanctity, Cut Through Fate, Flying Sleeves. Let's take another Cut Through Fate. I know I just said I need more defensive cards, but clearly I'm not doing that. Do I want to transform anything? I'm kind of happy with everything I have, so I'm not sure if I should transform. Yeah, let's skip this one, because I might want to go for the Popper Modifier, although that's a little unlikely there. All right, so here I rest for no reason. Okay, AoE fights. I don't have much AoE damage, but I think this should be fine. Let's do Fear No Evil, Cut Through Fate to kill this guy. I'll probably... Well, let's take a wheel kick, sure. And then I can do Empty Fist to Exit Wrath. Kill this guy with the wheel kick. And um, I think that's it. Yeah, I can wait for next turn to kill. Okay, let's do Crescendo, Indignation, Flurry of Blows. Should have done the Flurry of Blows first, obviously. And then kill you and kill you. Oh, uh, no, that's not enough. All right, so I have to do this. Okay. All right. 
We got a smoke bomb. Uh, yeah, this is this is probably the main reason I wouldn't want to go for the popper modifier because I get, if I see wish, I will probably take it. Tough choice. Um, hmm. Halt is not a bad idea in this deck too because I, I am in wrath often enough. Let me risk going for the popper modifier and let's take the halt instead. All right, resting again for no reason. Ideally, I would get the ability to dig or gain. Oh, dead branch. Whenever you exhaust a card, add a round card into your hand. Very interesting. I do have a few cards that exhaust, including the Miracle. All right, uh, let's do Indignation, Empty Fist, Sashweb. Yep, so Weakness, and then I can also play the Empty Body. All right, taking two damage there, which is fine. Another seven, let's do Flurry of Blows, Crescendo, then Cut Through Fate, and I should be able to kill here. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, Another well, battle him is really good. Not against the hexagos, but generally afterwards, let's take the battle him. Even though simmering fury would have given me, well, would have helped towards a collector bonus. All right, nothing great here. Probably another cut through fate, another inner peace, trying to get more collector bonuses. I'll take a consecrate as well. Um, yeah, tungsten raw would have been amazing, but I can't afford that. Prostrate. I am really lacking defense here, which makes me a little worried about the upcoming boss fight. Okay. All right, let's do Fear No Evil, Inner Peace. Okay, Consecrate. Sure. Empty Fist. Should be able to transform him here, right? Uh, Flurry of Blows. I won't be able to play both of them. And the Flurry of Blows, I hope to get back. Let's do Tranquility. And then Flurry of Blows, Empty Fist again. Okay. And then I'll do Cut Through Fate. Flurry of Blows and uh, yeah, let's do Sash Whip. I should be able to kill fairly easily next turn. Okay, so Cut Through Fate kills one and the Empty Fist the other. All right. Okay, I need defense. Let's take another Halt. A little bit defensive, I guess. Okay. Uh, wheel Kick kills someone here. Let's kill the one who attacks the most. Okay. And then I think I'll do Miracle, Fear No Evil. And um, for some reason, oh yeah, I can't exit Wrath, right? So let's do Crescendo, mm -hmm. Consecrate, and then uh, Sashwood. All right, very easy act so far. Pressure point, signature move, another halt, sure. Okay. All right, first and only Elite. Um, hmm, what's my strategy here? I don't really have any powers that I want to wait on. I probably want to enter Calm, though. So let's wait this turn. Okay, and this turn I should probably also wait. Okay, all right, this turn is though the turn that I probably should attack. Okay, Sense of Time would have been the other good thing to wait on. All right, let me see what the Miracle gives me. Munitions, what would I want to double play? Double play Battle Him? That might be a little excessive. Double play... Maybe I just don't double play anything, maybe I'll just keep going as I would. So let's do Flurry of Blows Crescendo, then Flurry of Blows again. Wheel Kick seems like a good idea. Okay, and then um, I probably should do Simmering Fury for extra card draw next turn, or Cut Through Fate for extra damage. Probably should try, actually this will be 40, that's not quite enough next turn. Let's do, hmm, let me drink the Distill Chaos, see what that plays. Sash whip, cut through fate. Uh, actually, I'll keep the empty fist. And empty fist, all right. Yeah, I think that was totally worth that potion, right? I can even do uh, crescendo, and then I should be able to... Actually, I might kill it this turn. Good. Got meal ticket. Whenever you enter a shop, heal 15 HP, as well as a strength potion. And yeah, I need defense, so I'll take the evaluate here. Okay, resting again to full HP. Yeah, I rested three times. I probably didn't need to rest a single time of those. All right, uh, let's do Inner Peace, Battle Him, and Cut Through Fate. Next turn, I probably don't need any of these. Yeah, let's, well, let's keep the Empty Fist, sure. Okay. Ooh, that is a lot of incoming. Um, yeah, that's a lot of incoming. All right, let's do, let's see what the Miracle gives me. Okay, Weave is probably not super necessary. Let's do Flurry of Blows. Okay, so let's do inner peace, see what I can draw. Yeah, it will be very difficult to perfect against this. Okay, so let's do 
Uh, tough choice. All right, let's do... Uh, hmm. I have two ways of enter Wrath and two ways to exit it. So I should probably enter Wrath first. So let's do Indignation. Okay. Flurry of Blows, Consecrate, Cut Through Fate. Empty Body is pretty good. Well, it helps a little, I guess. And then I want to exit it with Fear No Evil. Okay. Flurry of Blows again. Yeah, there's nothing I can do here. Um, so I'll, I'll do Empty Body and Empty Fist, but yeah, I guess... Could I have done anything? I, I would have had to lose a lot of HP in this fight. It was a risk. I think, yeah. It, I think it's definitely possible to perfect this one if I had dropped down my HP. But uh, I just, my deck was not defensive enough, which I think was the major flaw in this whole idea. All right, let's do Halt. That's actually enough defense. All right. And then I can do Cut Through Fate. Another Halt is fine. Actually, I don't need it this turn. And then just Smite Weave. Ooh, Blasphemy is interesting. Okay, 20 incoming. Yeah, since I'm already not perfecting, I don't care too much about taking damage. Let's just double smite, and next turn I should be able to kill with these Sons of Time. Okay. All right, a little unfortunate about perfecting this one. I definitely think it could be done. It would have been very difficult, though. Um, I don't think I want to give up the Popper modifier for any of these cards. Ragnarok would have been a good choice, but I think it's fine to skip this. Snekoi. I have too many zero cost cards, right? So I don't think I can take Snekoi. Do I want to take Philosopher's Stone? Actually, Fusion Hammer is great, right? Get an energy out of your turn. You can no longer smith the rest side since I already can no longer smith the rest sides. Okay. All right. Bronze Automaton at the end here. Yeah, again, one elite, one shop. The elite is uh, relatively soon, though. I have to be a little mindful of that. Cut through fate. Uh, Sash Whip seems like a good, good idea for weakness. Okay. Evaluate to be fully defended and inner peace. Sure. Okay, and then here let's do Crescendo Indignation for the Vulnerability. And then Cut Through Fate for one more Cut Through Fate. Uh-huh. And Carve Reality and Empty Fist for a kill. At least I'm doing good in time, right? How much? 11 minutes already on Act 2. Not bad. Another Halt. That's a lot of... Yeah, that's a Collector Bonus on Halt, sure. Okay. Alright, Sphery Guardian. Definitely Simmering Fury, right? Uh, let's also do the Crescendo. And then cut through Fade 1. And um, I'll... I'll keep both of them. That way I can exit Wrath if I have to. And then Empty Fist here. Alright. Okay, 20 incoming. Do I just... No, this is not even enough. Alright, let's do Halt. Flurry of Blows. Uh, indignation doesn't even matter here, right? Yeah, let me do Empty Fist... And then a Flurry of Blows again, Indignation, Flurry of Blows one more time, Empty Fist. And I could even do Crescendo one more time, but that seems... Ex Actually, here you know, I can do Crescendo. Oh, for some reason I thought I could play the Sense of Time. Well, that was silly. Actually, I can just kill here. Alright, well, that was a easy victory. We've got a Blessing of the Forge, Third Eye, Deceive Reality, or Consecrate. I need Defense, so I will take the Deceive Reality. Okay. Um, upgrade to random card, transform, remove, upgrade. I don't think I need to remove anything, so let's just upgrade to random cards. Sash Whip and Deceive Reality got upgraded, not bad. The first upgrade in this whole game, right? Alright, let's do Crescendo. Oh, Brilliance is not bad. Let's do Halt first. Evaluate, and then I can exit Wrath with the Empty uh, Fist, so let's do Brilliance and Empty Fist, okay. Alright, six incoming. Let's do Simmering Fury, Sash Whip, Empty Fist, Empty Fist. Okay. Mm -hmm. 20 incoming. I can exit with the Fear No Evil. Let me see if there's other things I can do first. Indignation is not bad for vulnerability. Alright. Okay, and then Fear No Evil. And a Flurry of Blows. And then I can probably do Deceive Reality. Um, or... Yeah, let's do Deceive Reality. That way I only lose 3 HP. Mm -hmm. Another 14. This is not yet enough. Oh, I don't have a way to enter Wrath, do I? I do still have a Crescendo in the deck, so let me do Insight. Okay, Halt 1, Halt 2. Alright, and then Sands of Time. Actually, with the Vulnerability, that was enough. We got an Energy Potion. I mean, I don't need the Smoke Bomb, right? So let's take it. 
and then here empty body which would be my third or the tranquility which would be my second both of them are upgraded let's take the empty body it's basically the same plus extra block okay all right let's do inner piece halt halt yeah not the best opener okay all right 19 incoming glory of blows indignation okay glory of blows again halt and then empty body and i can kill this guy good yeah the flurry, flurry of blows i think in this particular deck where i have a lot of stance shifts is a pretty good idea although i do have to worry a little bit about defense here let's do yeah empty body and safety okay just losing one hp with that mm -hmm. all right probably don't want to enter wrath here probably just want to do simmering fury for next turn I do need to block, and I don't have any block cards. All right, fine. Let me do Crescendo, Flurry of Blows, then Miracle. See what I get. Establishment is interesting, but probably not necessary here. Fear No Evil is pretty good. Okay, so I can do Fear... Hang on. Yeah, let's do Fear No Evil, Flurry of Blows again, Empty Body. No, inner PC, what I can draw. Halt, cut through fate. No, um, can I defend in any way? Not really, right? Um, all right, let's do empty fist. That gives me energy back. Flurry of blows again, and actually I can kill. All right. Colorless potion, probably not necessary. Nirvana, spirit shield, flying knee, uh, flying sleeves. Probably none of, well, I should take a card. I need to get to 50 cards anyway. Let's take the flying sleeves then. Okay, resting back to full. All right. All right, Gremlin Leader. Can I kill one of the minions? That's going to be very important. Let's do... Yeah, with Indignation, I should be able to, right? So it's 30. Yeah, that's too much even. Let's do Cut Through Fate. Um, Sash Whip is fine. And then let's do Sash Whip. And should have done the other order. Okay. Would have actually applied Weakness, too, if I did it in the other order. Flurry of Blows. And then... Yeah, let's do Fear No Evil. No reason to play the Sense of Time yet. Uh, and I don't think there's a reason to play Halt either. Okay, 18. Flurry of Blows. Okay. Oh, I'm not, not... For some reason, I thought I was in Wrath. Okay, that's a problem. Uh, let me do Cut Through Fate. Get rid of both of these. And then Cut Through Fate again. I kind of wanted attacks because I want to kill this guy too. Didn't get any attacks. That's not good. Let's do Inner Peace. Flurry of Blows. That's good. Empty body, and... Okay, so I can kill the minions after all. Good. Mm -hmm. And then let's do battle trans... Uh, battle him, sorry. Crescendo. Glory of blows. And sorry if there's background noise. There's something going on outside of my window here. And sands of time. Okay. I don't need that much damage to kill, so I think I'm very close. All right, let's do smite and empty fist for kill. Perfect. All right, sorry about that. I uh, made a, some makeshift sound installation because the noise was driving me insane. But anyway, moving on. All right, so a third flurry of blows. I mean, for this deck, it's actually pretty good. I really just need a... Um, what is that card called? The one that um, you get block every time you attack somebody. Something with hand. Anyway, I think I'm in a good position here. All right, let's move on. Okay, so uh, let's do inner... Well, actually, let me see what Cutthroat Fate gives me first. Uh, crescendo is not a bad idea. We'll deal a good amount of damage here. Okay. And then Consecrate Bowling Bash. I would get the bird to the ground. Actually, I'm pretty sure there are other ways to get the bird to the ground. Let me see if I can draw something defensive. Yeah, Empty Body is pretty good. Okay. Yeah, let's just do Empty Body then. A little bit of block at least. Actually, let me see what the Miracle gives me. Inner Peace. Uh, let me just do Bowling Bash and be done with the bird. I'll take th three damage. I'll be able to heal very quickly. All right, so let's do... I mean, yeah, this is no reason to play the halts there, but why not? Okay. Sands of Time. Let's do Indignation. Actually, no, let me do... Hmm. I kind of want to be in Wrath because next turn I'll deal 40 damage with the Sands of Time. So let's just do this. I'll also play the Evaluate. Okay. All right, 42 incoming. Flurry of Blows. 
And then sends of no, hang on. Let me see if I can draw something good. Flying sleeves and ooh, am I weakened? Actually, I can do no. Yeah, I messed up here. I should have had extra energy, so I could have played the crescendo and get energy back. You know what? Just to avoid taking 21 damage, I will drink the energy potion here. It's a little bit wasteful, but um, I think it's worth it to preserve the HP. Actually, no, that was really wasteful, right? Because I was gonna rest here anyway. All right, that's fine. Study Nirvana Wreath of Flame. I'm not a big fan of any of it. Study is upgraded and uh, it is fine. I do have a lot of zero cost cards. Sundial, every three times you shuffle a drop pile, gain two extra energy. And then here, yeah, I should have just taken the damage in the last fight, kept that energy potion because I, I would have healed back to full anyway. All right, 21 incoming. Let's do Crescendo Halt Brilliance. It's a pretty good thing. And then uh, let me do Empty Fist first and then Empty Body. Okay. I'll accept 20, uh, two damage here. All right, Flurry of Blows. Let me see if I can get a Wrath. Uh, yes, I can do Indignation here. All right, Gate Halt, Flurry of Blows, uh, Cut Through Fate, and let's do another Cut Through. Actually, no, I won't be able to kill, so let's just do Tranquil. Actually, yeah, let's do Tranquility, Flurry of Blows again, and then the Evaluate, okay. All right, uh, let me do... I should be able to kill here, right? So Empty Fist gives me energy, Insight, Simmering. Actually, I think I can just do this. All right. Yeah, again, sorry about the noise. Anyway, moving on. Signature move, just like your crush joints. Uh, it's weird I don't have any of these. Crush joints, maybe not a bad idea. Yeah, my problem is defense at this point. I have a lot of offensive cards, just not enough defense. Let's do Fear No Evil, Halt Halt, Empty Fist, and uh, I'll take a little bit of damage, that's okay. Alright, and then uh, let's see, Inner Peace, Study is not a bad idea, Consecrate, and then the Cut Through Fates. I'll actually play a Simmering Fury, yeah, that'll give me energy next turn too, okay. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, that's a lot of incoming, I could do Indignation, Halt. And then I can always exit with the Empty Fist, right? Let me see what I can draw. Cut a uh, Flurry of Blows. Actually, it's not a bad thing to... Yeah, let, let me keep... I actually have two Empty Fists in my hand, right? So let's keep it for next turn. So Flurry of Blows, Empty Fist. And then I think I'll do another... Crush well, let's do the Cut... Yeah, Flurry of Blows again. Crescendo. Kill this guy. Empty Fist. Another Flurry of Blows. Actually, I can do this one more time, right? Um, Yeah, let me do Miracle Tranquility. Okay, Flurry of Blows again, then the Crescendo, one more Flurry of Blows, and actually I'm fully defended this way, right? Alright, could have played the Master of Reality, no reason not to, but I'm also pretty sure I can kill here. Um, 18 with the Vulnerability is enough, alright? Okay, follow-up Cutthroat Fate, how many Cutthroat Fates do I have? Oh yeah, this will be a Collector Bonus, so let's pick that. Okay, and then, yeah, see, if I had a rare card I would get max HP. And I don't. Uh, so I don't really think I need to lose anything here. Which one do I like least? I'm probably okay giving up the study. Just because, yeah, basically if I have either the um, time meter at the end or the awakened one, study is going to be bad. So it's only good for Dono and Deca, but I, I'm probably fine without it. Okay. All right. And then late shop, I do have a lot of gold to spend. Probably going to buy all of the relics here. Got bronze scales, so I should come with three thorns. Eternal Feather for every five cards in your deck, heal three HP. Actually, I don't. I definitely don't need that. Melange, whenever you shuffle, drop off, scry three. I mean, not a bad idea to have. Let's take it. And then I can take one more empty body for a collector bonus. Let's do that. Foresight is not a bad idea. Let's take it. Carve Reality. And I'll take the Liquid Memories and another Blessing of the Fortress. Probably too much. Let's take a Gambler's Brew. Okay. All right, resting for no reason. This is why Eternal Feather would have been pretty useless because I'm already resting for no reason too often. All right, let's do Flurry of Blows, um, Wheel Kick, see what I can draw. Receive Reality is good to play, and I'll do Fear No Evil just for the damage. Okay, 14 incoming. Let's do... Oh, do I have trouble defending here? I guess I have a safety. Yeah, let me use Sash Whip, Carve Reality. And then, yeah, I have to do safety and empty body. Okay. That's fine. This guy took sense of time. That's okay. You can have it. 
And this guy took an NPC. Yeah, you can have both of them. I don't care too much about them. All right, I do have 16 incoming here. And again, somewhat trouble defending. Let's do crush joints, crescendo. Then a flurry of blows. Judgment does only 30. It'll be hard to get some one of the minions down that low. But I think I'll try. Definitely halt. And then empty body will give me enough block, right? So I can do one more attack. Let me actually... Mm, should I keep the miracle? Let me see what it plays. Vault. That's actually not a bad idea. Yeah, let's do vault. Okay. Alright, indignation is pretty good. Uh, let me do flurry of blows first. Then indignation. Okay. Then consecrate. Smite kills... Um... Oh, actually, no, that was bad, right? Because now I don't have any block. Uh, I guess I could liquid memories. What could give me 16 block or kill? I could liquid memories to judgment. And that could give me an inner peace. Uh, that's not enough block, though. Let me see. Is there anything else I can do? Let me do smite. Oh, there's a bowling bash. Okay, so that kills one of them. All right, and then I can do inner peace and never mind. Yeah, so I can't kill. Okay, good. All right, this guy doesn't have artifact anymore, so that's a good good news. Twenty incoming. Uh, this is not easy for me here. I won't be able to fully defend. I can't even draw something good to defend with. So I think will the gambler's brew even help? Not really, right? So I would have to draw. And evaluate. No, I don't think I can draw anything here. Hmm. Let me do the Blessing of the Forge. I should have done the Attack Potion first, probably, right? What can I give back with the um, Liquid Memories that would allow me to defend a lot? I guess the most defense is the Empty Body, 10 block. It's a start. Alright, let's do Liquid Memories, the Empty Body. Play that. Okay. Flurry of Blows, sure. And then um, I can enter Wrath with the Crescendo. Okay. All right. More um, Flurry of Blows. And then let's see if I can draw one more defensive card. Get rid of all of these. And Halt. Yeah, that's enough. All right. Now I just have to exit with the Empty Fist. Okay. So that was a close call. I'll, I'll keep the Flurry of Blows, actually. All right. Let's do that. And then Foresight, Worship, and Empty Fist. Okay. Oh, should have played all the other Flurry of Blows there. Alright, Evaluate. I don't need any block this turn. I'll keep the Tranquility just in case. Alright. Scrying a little bit too. Cutthroat Fate is fine. I'll get rid of the rest. Okay. Alright, so let's do Tranquility, Crush... Whoops, Crush Joints. Uh, let's see what the Foreign Influence gives me. I can't play the Ragnarok. I'll do Flying Knee for extra energy next turn. So let's do that. And then uh, Bowling Basher. Alright. Okay, defending this turn might be difficult. 51 incoming. Um, I do have Inner Peace. That's good. Let me get rid of everything that's not defensive. Okay, can I kill here? The enemy is vulnerable. Mm, I do have Sense of Time upgraded. 39 with, vulner with the... Uh, once I can enter Wrath... That'll be quite a bit, but actually, looks like the only way I could enter Wrath is the Indignation, right? Hmm. Might be a little tough. Let's do Inner Peace. Oh, there's Worship. Okay. Yeah, and now this deals 117 damage. That also allows me to get the Overkill modifier. Pretty good. Got a Strength Potion, Judgment Master Reality, or a Diva Form. Probably none of these again. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll commit to the Popper modifier. Alright, so here... Hmm. Probably don't need extra energy. I think I'll go with Black Star. Elite, uh, elite drop initial relic when defeated. Okay. All right, time eater. Yeah, that's a little bad. I have a lot of zero cost cards. That might be that might be a tough fight. So, I might want to rely a lot on potions. Okay. All right. So flurry of blows. Uh, wheel kick after I can gain some block. Let's do halt. Wheel kick. Okay. Alt again, deceive reality, and 16 incoming. Let's do a safety here, sure. Okay. Alright, 9 incoming. Flurry of Blows, Sash Whip. 
inner piece. Explorer. I should probably kill this explorer guy quickly. And then I can do simmering. Well, let me just do smite here. And uh, yeah, fine. I'll do the simmering fury for next turn. Okay. Mm -hmm. No one is attacking me. Good. Can I get some block? Um, well, I guess empty body is the only block I can get, which is unfortunate. Let me see if I can draw something good first. Nope. Get rid of both of these. And get rid of this one. Okay, so I'll do empty body, and then I guess the strongest attack is the empty fist, okay. I could have done crescendo, I guess. Yeah, I'll wait for a good defensive card before I continue attacking the spiker. Okay, this is not what I meant, but I guess I can do halt, or judgment. Yeah, that works. Okay, we've got a speed potion, sash whip, weave, or conclude. Uh, did I have a sash whip already? I did, so let's take a second one. Potential collector bonus there. Okay, or walker. So, Crescendo, Crush Joints, Halt, Empty Body, and then I'll do Collect After the Miracle. Uh, too bad I can't play the Tantrum. Mm -hmm. 18. Deceive Reality, Flurry of Blows, should have played that first. Halt, Inner Peace, get that Flurry of Blows back. And uh, Safety, sure, no reason to lose HP here. Alright. And then uh, here I can probably do something like Crescendo, Flurry of Blows, Halt, then Fear No Evil, Flurry of Blows, Cut Through Fate, and I should be able to kill with another Crescendo or Indignation, okay? Nirvana, Third Eye, Empty Fist. I don't scry enough for Nirvana to be worth it. I think I have enough Empty Fists, right? I do, Collector Bonus there. So let's take the Third Eye. I will need Defense, against, especially against the Time Eater. All right, Writhing Mass. This could be my first curse, but I, obviously I'm not going for the Curse of Modifier, so I don't think I'll go for that. Let's do Indignation, Halt, Battle Him, Inner Peace. I actually realized I don't have a single attack card. Let me see what the Miracle gives me. Crush Joints, okay. It would be funny if that gave me the curse. All right, 30 incoming. Let's do a Wheel Kick. Can I enter Wrath? No, do I want to enter Wrath? Yeah, why not? It'll give me energy back too. All right, Wheel Kick. 45, that's a little too much. Let's do Consecrate. All right, Fear No Evil, Empty Body, that'll give me block back, or uh, energy back, I mean. And then Carve Reality, Cut Through Fate. Sash was pretty good. Uh, although if, if he decides to um, give me the curse, I won't be able to avoid it. Nope, actually, this is pretty good, all right? Another 21. Let's do Simmering Fury for next turn. Inner Peace. Uh, I kind of want to defend against 21, but that'll be difficult. Let's do Empty Body. And then, um, I don't know, could I get something better? 16, Flurry of Blows, another. Smite, 21, follow up is free. 16 is probably better, yeah, let's stick with that. Okay. I'm losing a surprising amount of HP here. Let's do... Hmm, tough choice here. Let's do the upgraded sm or no, not the upgraded, just the smite. Glory of Blows, cut through fate. Wait, I can exit with the empty body, right? Halt is pretty good. Yeah, let's take that. Okay, and then I'll do empty fist, 22, and empty body. Okay, that way I'm also fully defended. Okay. Yeah, this is a surprisingly tough fight here. Foresight is pretty good. Uh, doesn't help me with defense, though. Flurry of Blows. I can do Tranquility and Empty Fist for block. Okay, or for energy, I mean. Let's see if I can get a different attack value. 48. No, that's not that's not exactly what I wanted. Let's do Smite. 22. I mean, yeah, I guess I'll stick with 22. Better than nothing. Do I have a rest side? I do. Yeah, so I should be fine. Another 10. Let's get rid of this. Okay. Let's do Crescendo. All right. Glory of Flows Halt. Sash Whip. Can I kill here? 40. Yeah, that's enough. All right, that was a rough fight. We got a Skill Potion, which I don't think I'll take. Follow up, Fear No Evil, Consecrate. I think I have one of Consecrate and the Fear No Evil, right? So uh, against the Time Eater, I should probably go for Strong Attack, so I'll go with the Fear No Evil. Mm hmm. All right, Jaw Worms. Let's do... Only one is attacking. Let's do Indignation, Crush Joints, Consecrate. 
a halt and then empty fist would kill, but I am... Actually, I'm not fully defended, let's just kill. Yeah, even if I exit Wrath, I, I would have taken two damage, which, I mean, not a big deal, but why take the damage, right? Uh, let's do halt, empty body, and then empty fist. Okay. I guess now I'm taking damage, so how much I could have done to avoid it. 26. Let's do Sash Whip. Flurry of Blow should have done that first. Car of Reality. And then let me do Tranquility. Get the Flurry of Blows back. Empty Body gives me energy back again. Flurry of Blows. Sash Whip. Okay. And then I can kill you. And uh, let me just fully defend. Should be able to kill this guy next turn, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can just do Crescendo Sands of Time. All right. So, Consecrate, Blasphemy, Pray. I know I shouldn't take another Consecrate. I only have one, though. Yeah, fine, let me take it. It's going to make my life against the Time Eater much harder, but it could be a Collector bonus, so who knows. All right, here, let me do Inner Peace, Deceive Reality, Halt, Empty Body. Uh, I can't even weaken with the Sash Whip, but I should be able to almost... Yeah, let's just fully defend here. Oh, what was that? I didn't notice. That was an emissions. Yeah, I could have used that actually quite a bit. All right, that's fine. Flurry of Blows, Fear No Evil. Okay. And then Flurry of Blows again. Crescendo. All right, Wheel Kick. Consecrate, Flurry of Blows, and now play the Collect. All right. Mental Fortress would have been nice. Yeah, Mental Fortress is the best card this deck would need right now. Because I am switching stances left and right here. Smite and Car Reality again. Perfect. Got really lucky with that random draw there. Okay, 120. Let's do Cut Through Fate. Uh huh. And then another Cut Through Fate. Okay. And then Flurry of Blows. Cut Through Fate again. And Empty Fist. Oh, actually, yeah, the Crescendo would have been nice because I would like to stay in, in Wrath. But I guess I can also just do, uh, let's see. Yeah, let's just do MP Fist. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, last turn. I do have a relatively cheap Sands of Time. Let me do Miracle, Crush Joints, Sands of Time. And uh, I should be close to killing here. Yep, perfect. Okay. All right, follow up consecrate. So I have two consecrates, and I think just one follow. Oh, no follow ups. Okay. So in that case, uh, yeah, third consecrate. Okay, I'm healing back. Not to full this time. Yeah, I lost a lot of HP against that writhing mass fight. Only elite here, nemesis, flurry of blows. Of course, I don't have enough defenses. Empty body. It's a start. Only ten block though. What can I do here? Um, I'm trying to think. Well, this would give me 15. It's not even enough, right? Hmm, what could I do? Not much. I mean, I have to use the Gamma Fury. Let's do Tranquility, Empty Body. Okay. And then uh, let's do the Gamma Room. Alright. And then in Ignition, I won't be able to exit Wrath. I don't think there's anything I can do. Aid. Yeah, I guess the only thing I can do is drink the Speed Potion. That will give me enough block here. What a shame. Fear No Evil is pretty good here. Okay, if I knew I was going to draw it. Uh, yeah, let's do Indignation and then Fear No Evil. Okay. Alright, at least I'm fully defended here. 45. Okay, he's not making it easy for us. Alright, let's do... Can't enter Wrath here, right? Let me see if the attack potion might give me a way to enter Wrath. Talk to the end. That's exactly what I needed. All right, talk to the end. This might give me a chance here then. Let's do Halt. Crush Joints. Swivel. That makes the sense of time free. It's only one damage, right? Doesn't matter too much. It gives me block. That's the important thing here. Let's do Empty Body. Flurry of Blows. Consecrate. Empty Fist. Uh, that's all. Yeah, no way I could have fully defended. Just got a little unlucky with the attack patterns. Let's do Crescendo, Flurry of Blows, um, and then Cut Through Fate. I'll take another Flurry of Blows, why not? Okay, and then Empty Fist, all right. Could have done more Flurry of Blows. Yeah, I keep forgetting to play those. That's, uh, oh, I'm not in Wrath anymore. All right, let's Weaken, okay. 
And then, um, yeah, I'm still taking a lot of damage. Let me see what the miracle gives me. Empty body. All right. Yeah, this is not looking super good. Should be able to kill here, though, right? Let's do cut through fate. Halt, inner peace. Hmm. Halt is defense. Let's keep the halt then. Okay. Actually, with crescendo, that might have been enough. But yeah, I think I'm fully defended here already. Okay. He is intangible this turn. Luckily, he's not attacking here. Good. Flurry of Plus. I am dealing one damage every time I attack, so I might as well, right? Let's keep the insight for later, though. All right. That was a hard fight. Yeah, I am clearly not going to get a super high score. Whoops. I don't care. I can kill with this might. Okay. We got White's Beast Statue. That's oh, really good. Potions always appear in combat rewards, as well as a bird faced urn. And... Yeah, it's a little too late for the wish, so I think I'm happy with my decision to go for the proper modifier. I could go, I think that would be my third Sash Whip, right? F or a second four side. Let's go with the third Sash Whip, though. Again, a lot of gold. Let's see. So definitely carve reality, evaluate, and deceive reality. Probably don't need to reach heaven. And I think I can afford all the um, relics here. We got Orichalcum. If you enter turn without blocking, six block. Letter opener. Every time play three skills in a single turn, deal five damage to all enemies. And I don't think I need Prismatic Shard. Let's also take the Like Water, as well as the Essence of Steel, Power Potion, Fear Potion. Yeah, I can I can just take everything here, right? Okay. All right, Juju Basin, normal enemy combats are normal encounter in Crush Mark Rooms. You know, it will only affect me two more times. Okay, Foresight, Inner Peace, Halt, Empty Fist, and Flying Sleeves. Okay. At least my potions are good. Uh, I'm getting attacked for 25. All right, so let's keep the defenses. Mm -hmm. So let's do... All right, that was not as defensive as I hoped it would be. Which is fine. I'll take some damage. Okay, now I don't need defenses anymore. All right, let's do Flurry of Blows. Um, and then actually I'm going to do the Crescendo. Crush Joints, more Flurry of Blows. Mm-hmm. Okay. 56 incoming. Well, Fear No Evil should help. Okay. All right, let's do Sash Web Weave. Sorry about that. All right, so, and then I think I'll do Sands of... No, um, I do want to do Fear No Evil so I can gain energy by exiting the Calm with Empty Body. Or I could exit with Crescendo again. Yeah, let's do it. Also allows me to play more Flurry of Blows. And then cut through fate for inside. Yeah, that, that will draw me the next thing anyway. And weave. Okay. And then fear no evil again. Look at this chain. Okay, more flurry of blows. I'm pretty sure I've played more than 20 cards already, right? So that's a good point bonus there. Third eye. And that's a good hand next turn. An empty body. Okay. I'm still taking some damage, though, even though I played a lot of cards. 18 incoming. I think I'll keep this. And then do indignation. Hang on. I cannot exit if I enter, right? Can I kill? I think I can kill, right? Let's do indignation. Halt. Flurry of blows. Weave. Sash whip and sense of time. Okay. All right. We got distilled chaos. Uh, I'm probably okay sacrificing one of the strength at the strength potions for that. And then another sash whip. I think that would be the collector bonus, right? Yep. Perfect. Okay. All right. Healing more. Transform a card. What do I only have one copy of? No, I could get a rare card. I don't want to risk it. I want to go for the proper modifier. And then here I could upgrade all cards. You can no longer heal. It's a little dangerous, but very interesting. I should probably go for a rare relic, though. And this time I actually have low enough HP that this shouldn't be a big deal. Let's do Hold Like Water, Empty Fist, Sash Whip. Okay, that way he'll be weakened next turn, too. Only 12 incoming. All right, third eye. Yeah, fine. Next turn, evaluate, consecrate. Okay. Actually, thanks to thorns, he gets he gets a lot of damage too. Six incoming, flurry of blows, foresight, crescendo is fine because I should be able to fully defend with the halt. Let's see if reality cut through fate, and uh, I think this is fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. Twenty incoming, indignation is fine. Apply some vulnerability. And then Consecrate Sash Whip. So it's down to 14, which I guess... Uh, yeah, I should do Empty Body here. All right. 
Okay, I can't resist. Let's also do Crescendo again. And then Flurry of Blows. Oh, why did I think... Hang on. I messed up. For some reason, I thought I would get extra energy. And I didn't. Let's just fully defend here. Okay. Yeah, my Sense of Time will be free next turn. Uh, Fear No Evil is good. Cut through Fate is fine. Okay. Let's do Flurry of Blows, Sands of Time, and Fear No Evil kills. No, this kills. All right. Okay, we got Mango up and pick up Rage from XP by 14, which is good, as well as Snack Oil, which I don't think I'll need. And I already have enough Sash Whips. How many Carve Realities do I have? Two. All right. Potential chance here to get a third one. Spire Growth. I'm not getting attacked this turn. That's good, although a very bad opening hand. Okay, 44 incoming. Flurry of Blows. Foresight. Let me see what the... Yeah, I can do Tranquility. Gain energy back with the Empty Body. Okay. More Flurry of Blows. Cutthroat Fate. Indignation. But I won't be... Actually, no, I can't exit it with the Empty Fist again, right? So it's Indignation. Flurry of Blows. Let me see what this gives me. Conclude. Let's do Third Eye. Fine Hand. And then Empty Fist. Okay. Am I still doing fine on time? Ooh. Oh, right, because I took a lot of breaks. All right, fine. Let's get rid of these two. 22 incoming. Mm, no way to exit Wrath. Uh, well, I mean, enter Calm for the Light Water. Let's do Crescendo. Flurry of Blows. Wallop is pretty good. And then I can do Empty Fist. Yeah, seems like a good idea here. Still taking a little bit of damage. Okay. Should be able to kill next turn, though. Let's get rid of the non-offensive cards. All right. Fear no evil. Wheel kick. Yep. Okay. Liquid memories. It's fine. Uh, let's take meditate here. And then heal. Yeah, I can't believe that. I'm actually sort of looking forward to healing. Okay. So this is going to be a tough fight. Let's drink the essence of steel and the strength potion right away. Um, so I can't do Crescendo. Let me see what the Cutthroat Fate gives me. Indignation, Tranquility. Um, yeah, I need the Tranquility first. I probably still don't want to do Crescendo, though. I think I will have to concede this turn. I could do Like Water. Yeah, that might help. All right, so let's do Like Water. It's a little dangerous playing the, the Silk Chaos, but otherwise I can't defend, so let's try Summoning Fury, Inner Peace, and Consecrate. Okay. Mm. Yeah, there's not much I can do here. Yeah. I think my deck... I, I got too excited. I think this was the perfect stance shift deck. So if I had any cards that would support me. So the... Uh, I forgot the name of the card, but... Um, ma no, not Master Reality. The one that gives you block every time you shift stances. That would have been perfect in this deck. And, or even something like... Uh, the talk to the hand. That would have been great too. But sadly, I didn't get any of those. Um, let me exit Wrath real quick with a Tranquility. Okay. And then Spirit Shield is perfect here. Probably overkill though. Okay. I might not even survive because I, I think my deck is lacking strong damage. I guess Sands of Time is the best damage card there. Uh, let's do Deceive Reality. Foresight is good. Third Eye. Okay. Next turn. Fear No Evil is fine. So let's just do Consecrate and yeah. Th I mean, this is a ex great example of a turn where I can't defend whatever I do. Okay. All right, this is fine. Let's get rid of the Flurry of Blows. I think those are going to be the least useful cards here. Let's do... kind of want to play the... Uh, actually, here, let me do Crescendo. Then I can do Free Crush Joints. Carve Reality. Smite. Okay. Sands of Time is pretty good. 66 damage here, so that'll force him to transform. And then I can do... Um, let me get him to transform now, actually. No, it's fine. Actually, next turn, um, I don't think I will be able to kill with two cards. Oh, Meditate is pretty good. I'll keep everything here. Alright, let's do Halt. And Meditate. And I'm going to Meditate something that allows me to enter... Wrath again. Where is the indignation? There it is. Oh, and then want to exit it as well. So maybe something like Calm or Inner Peace. Okay. Alright, so he's back to half HP. 30 incoming. Sash Whip is good. Halt is good. Yeah, that's a good hand. Alright, so let's do Like Water. Indignation. Okay. And then Halt. Cut through Fate. Another Halt is pretty good. Okay. 
And then I should have done the Sash Whip. I guess I have to do Flurry Blows and then Sash Whip. Alright, 45. And then let's do Inner Peace. And I think that's it. Uh, yeah, I am fully defended. I could play four more cards. Uh, he'll gain strength, but I think that's fine. Okay. Yeah, still technically fully defended. Alright, another Sash Whip Empty Fist. Yeah, let's make him weaken for a while. Alright, so it looks like I'll get through this. I was a little worried for nothing there. Let's do Christian. Actually, let me do Inner Peace first. Draw cards, then Crescendo. Okay. Uh, have to be a little careful, but I think this should be close to enough. 22. Um, let me see what Inside gives me. Okay, Fear No Evil, Empty Fist, Flurry of Flows, and then... Oh, I don't have energy for the Empty Fist? Actually, he's dead. Alright. Uh, that was that was rough. I did very poorly here. I think I start off 1107. It's not bad, but uh, definitely far from what could it be. Out of the three elites, I only perfected two. Only perfected one of the three bosses. Did get overkill in combo and pop run and scoop So that was pretty good. Five collector bonuses, raining money. I did so. Oh, speed start. I did so well in the first two acts, and then uh, act three was a little harder. But in terms of time, I mean, let's see where we stand in the rankings. Uh, yeah, Vorpal score I think is is pretty insane. Uh, 1282, I guess. Let me think, if I perfected two more bosses, it would have been uh, 1,257. So then in addition to that, he probably also got another collector bonus or something else or perfect another elite. So that's a really good score. I'm, I'm very impressed by that. So so good job. Let me know in the comments what you did. I would assume, let me start this run again, just so we can go through the cards. I would assume that, yeah, I think I focused too much on sort of the cool stance shift decks. I probably should have gone more for something like Deceive Reality. A little more defense would have definitely helped there, but... Sadly, that didn't happen. Anyway, I'm going to abandon this. So, yeah, it happens too. Sorry for the background noise again. Uh, hopefully, it'll be gone tomorrow. So, thanks for watching. Bye.